welcome to the next video. So today we will be tackling the interior of the Yaris. Now, as you would have seen in the previous episode, um, we gave the outside an extreme wash. Um, what I'll do is I'll insert a few clips from the beading that happened overnight. Um, it didn't rain, but it did freeze. So there are still a few water droplets on there. So, okay, so onto the interior. This is gonna be a very short video, purely based on the fact that the interior on a Yaris is ultimately very small. So it shouldn't take too long to do. And to be fair, it's not in that bad a condition. It just needs a good, 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 good clean. So without further ado, let's sort the interior out. But one thing's first, I do apologize for any wind noise from the previous video. And if there is any wind noise in this video, for some reason, being in the UK, it can be really extremely sunny and still be very windy. So interior of this car, obviously it needs a good hoover, but it's not too bad. I mean, the seats need a good scrub. Um, we don't have the facilities to be able to give it a deep wash, but just a little de hair and a hoover should be uh, sufficient. So what I'll do is I'll get my lovely assistant again to do the hoovering as I'm probably about the same size as this car and struggle to get in and out of all the little nooks and crannies. Um, obviously that means I get to get all the best angles and my lovely assistant gets all hot and sweaty doing the uh, hoovering. So let's get cracking. and all done. Uh, now time to do the little bit of detail in the cabin of the car. So we're going to start with the steering wheel just because that is the most dirty. Obviously that's where the, all the traffic is. Um, obviously I've got the gloves on because it is that disgusting. Um, we're going to be using some Yum Interior along with a fresh utility towel from again Yum Cars and we've got a de detailing brush just to make sure we can get into all the little nooks and crannies and finally a cotton bud just because there are areas where I don't really want to put loads of the, the yum interior in so let's get cracking
floating through the air. The pain I felt is paid for, all is said and done. works perfectly with the interior because the interior of what I was using has eucalyptus and this is another citrusy smell lemon zest so all I do is a couple of squirts in each foot well and that's the interior all done that's it all done the Yaris is now if we wanted to fit for sale um, we are undecided of what we want to do it is a good little car you know it's going to fly through the next MOT um, so do we get it the bits that need doing doing or do we just set it as it is I don't know but I hope you enjoyed I said it was a very short one this video but I hope you enjoyed the series there's many more to come we've got a TIG one to do yet and that is pure kill and if, as I said, if you like the video give it a like subscribe that would massively help me on my way to get it on MacBook Pro and yeah have a great day and stay safe No, there ain't no stopping us. Fly without boarding pass. Couldn't catch me, I'll be moving fast. Call me a shooting star. Let them know who you are. Flying up in a bar. Wish on a star. Time to show them who's in charge. Call me a shooting star. Even get to oh.